Here's a demonstration suggested by uh, Hovan on PTNC. Here I've got the um, two keepers on top of a stack of ceramic magnets. Um, and I'm just going to get rid of that stool. And Hovan asked, well, I think he probably knows what's going to happen, but what would happen if I approached this stack of magnets from above with another stack of magnets either attracting or repelling? So I've got another stack of ceramic magnets hovering above so that they're attracting. That's why I'm holding on to the bottom stack. And you can see what... Ha whoops. Ugh. You can see what happens to the two keepers. When they're brought together, attracting. And now if I bring them together, repelling. This gets very unstable. Uh, as you can see, you can uh, again see what happens. Another thing that's nice to notice about this is that if you have just the one keeper and you twang it, the period of the oscillation twanged it too much. The period of the oscillation depends on the field strength. So if I bring another magnet, uh, another stack in from above repelling, the period decreases somewhat. Hopefully you can see that there, it's quite slow. Whereas if I bring the stack in attracting, I mean, you're unlikely to be able to discern it, but the period has definitely decreased. It's definitely twanging, vibrating, oscillating much faster when they're attracting rather than repelling. It's hard to actually <laughs> get it stable when they're repelling. So another few demos to be done with just a stack of magnets and a couple of uh, bits and bobs.